Hi guys, I hope you are all doing well. Let's see today's question. So today's question, we are taking this up from the topic of matrices and determinants. And if I talk about the question which is given to us here from this topic, the question tells us that if P is a matrix of 2 by 2, which is having the elements root 3 by 2, 1 over 2, 1 minus 1 over 2, and the other element is also root 3 over 2. The other matrix, it says A is equals to 1, 1, 0, 1. And one more condition is given to us that says Q is P into A into P transpose. And if the question is giving you one more condition that says if P transpose into Q raised to 2007 into P is equal to matrix A, B, C, D, then find the value of an expression which says 2A plus B minus 3C minus 4D. That is equal to what? So if I talk about the answer choices that we have here, they are 2004. 2006, 2007, and the last answer choice given to us is 2005. So we need to figure out which one of the answer choices is the correct answer for the question that is given to us. Before starting off with the solution, I would first like to tell you that please do subscribe to my channel and support the channel as well because it takes lots of efforts in making these videos for you on everyday basis. Let's see the solution for this question now. So if I have the matrix P with me, which says root 3 over 2, 1 over 2, minus 1 over 2, and root 3 over 2. So if I have these four elements of the matrix P, and if I find the transpose of that same matrix, which has the elements root 3 over 2, minus half, half, and root 3 over 2. So I have these two matrices P and P transpose with me. And if I take the product of those two matrices, so I get here root 3 over 2, half, minus half, and root 3 over 2. And the transpose of that matrix gives you root 3 over 2, minus half, half, and root 3 over 2. So once I have the two matrices multiplied, let's see what I get the answer as. So root 3 over 2 into root 3 over 2, which is 3 over 4. Half into half, which is 1 over 4. Second, root 3 over 2 into minus half, which is minus root 3 over 4. And half into root 3 by 2, which is basically root 3 over 4. Third, minus half into root 3 over 2, which is minus root 3 over 4. And root 3 over 2 into half, which is root 3 over 4. The last one, you get minus half into minus half, basically, which is 1 over 4. And root 3 by 2 into root 3 by 2, which is 3 by 2. So if I see this, I get this as 1, 0, 0, 1. So I get P into P transpose is basically an identity matrix, which is 1, 0, 0, 1. So that's basically your identity matrix, which is present. So I can also write if I find out P transpose into P, which will again give you root 3 over 2 minus half, half and root 3 over 2. And multiplying that with my P matrix, which is root 3 over 2, 1 over 2 here, minus 1 over 2 here, and root 3 over 2 here. So if I'm multiplying this also, this is also going to give me the same thing, 1, 0, 0, 1, which is basically an identity matrix, which is 1 in this case. Now, once I know this, that this is basically 1 because it's an identity matrix, they have given us one condition which says, Q is equal to P into A into P transpose. So if I have Q is equal to P A P transpose, let's solve this further. So let's see what I get here. So if I want to find Q raised to 2007, because if you see in the next condition, they have given us Q raised to 2007 somewhere. So I have to find Q raised to 2007. So I'm multiplying this entire product 2007 times so p a p transpose one time p a p transpose second time then p a p transpose third time and like this i'm multiplying this 2007 times so when i'm multiplying this 2007 times let's see what i get so i get here p transpose into p which basically we know it is one we have just figured out that because it's an identity matrix 
again this is p transpose into p which is again one again you will have p transpose into p which will be one so i understand that only first matrix p is here then you have a a a only multiplied because all the p transposes into p becomes one so you will have a and the last also if you see where you have p a and p transpose this p transpose into p becomes one and then a would be there which will be multiplied 2007 times right and when once that is multiplied the last matrix would be as it is so p transpose because it's not getting multiplied with p then so i am left with this idea for q raised to 2007 so now the question tells me that p transpose into q raised to 2007 into p so let's write that condition so it's told to me that p transpose into q raised to 2007 into p this matrix is equal to it's given to us as a b c d so if i write this a b c d so that is the idea given to us let's see so p transpose q raised to 2007 we just figured out it in terms of a now so let's put this so p a raised to 2007 into p transpose into p is equal to a b c d so here if i see now p transpose into p that gives you one p transpose into p here this also gives you one so you get from here one and one so you get a raised to 2007 is nothing but a b c d so let's just try to find a raised to 2007 now now once i have my matrix a with me which is given to me as 1 1 0 1 i can square it and that gives me 1 1 0 1 1 1 0 1 so if i multiply this two i get 1 into 1 which is 1 1 into 0 is 0 so 1 plus 0 1 1 into 1 1 1 plus 1 2 this gives you 0 into 1 plus 1 into 0 which is 0 0 into 1 plus 1 into 1 which is basically 0 plus 1 which is 1 a cubed if i find out a square 1 2 0 1 and one more a i'm multiplying so 1 1 0 1 this gives me 1 into 1 plus 2 into 0 which is 1 1 into 1 plus 2 into 1 which is 3 0 into 1 plus 1 into 0 0 0 into 1 plus 1 into 1 which is 0 plus 1 1 so i get this now if i see i am getting a pattern here so a raised to 4 if i find out with that pattern without even multiplying i can just say it will be 1 4 0 and 1 so 1 0 and 1 are remaining as it is and this basically becomes same as the power of the matrix so with that same pattern which is being followed i can say a raised to 2007 it is 101 and 2007 so i get this matrix for a raised to 2007 so we get 1 2007 0 and 1 once i have that with me i know already that a raised to 2007 consists of these elements a b c d so from here if i put it a b c d is equals to 1 2007 0 and 1 so i get the values of a 1 b 2007 c 0 and d is 1 now once i have all the four values with me the question is asking me to find out the value of an expression which is 2a plus b minus 3c minus 4d so that gives me 2 into 1 plus b which is 2007 minus 3c which is 3 into 0 minus 4 into d which is 1 so you get 2 plus 2007 minus 0 minus 4. So 2007 plus 2 which is 2009 minus 4 which is 2005. So I get the answer for the value of this expression as 2005. And if I see that matches with the answer choice D. So D becomes a correct answer here for the question that is given to us here. I hope you have understood how to solve this question which gives the concepts or which uses the concepts of matrices so we first figured out p into p transpose that gave me identity matrix p transpose into p would also give you that same identity matrix which turns out one then with the condition i figured out q raised to 2007 is p into a raised to 2007 into transpose of that i put that in the con next condition given and i got from there that a raised to 2007 is nothing but this elements a b c d 
then i figured out a ratio 2007 with using the pattern that is being followed by multiplying a's continuously so i got the values of a b c d once i got the values of a b c d i just got my answer for the expression that is asked to us and that matches with 2005 so that basically becomes a correct answer for the question that is given to us i hope you have understood how to solve this i'll see you again tomorrow with some other question from some other topic and we are going to continue our series of questions on jwe mains so stay tuned for more videos to roll out also if you are enjoying these videos that we are doing every day please do like the videos as well and do subscribe to my channel and share these videos with your friends also who are involved in the preparation of questions on JWE. So they can also take the benefit from these questions which we are solving on everyday basis. Thank you.